In uh, Africa, we have a proverb, and uh, we say that if the tree will not support us when we lean on it, then we are also not worried if the tree falls, that it will fall on us. I see trees of green. Today is not only a special day for my husband and I, but it's also a true testimony of the goodness and faithfulness of God that knows no bounds or borders. It may sound like a cliche, but I believe that God was at work when me and I crossed paths. That's a story for another day if you don't know it. Oh my gosh, it looks so beautiful. Love found us in a wicked way when we weren't necessarily seeking it out. But see, that's how God works behind the scenes, putting pieces of this puzzle called life together. When I met Ni, my husband, I felt an ease. I felt like I was at home, and I felt like I had found peace. And before I could catch myself, I told the friends that I was with that Ni was going to be my husband. I don't think he knows that. This was the first day I met him. I told the friends I was with that this was going to be my husband. Today, you lose him, he flies away. Where do I start? Um, I notice you all call the groom knee, but for those of us from Ghana, we call him Gaiti. About four years ago, yeah, pretty much four years, right? I'm getting in touch with Gaiti, and he tells me, Listen, I found the ribs that were taken from me. The bone of my bone, the flesh of my flesh. I said, who is this lady? And then I get to know that it's a beautiful lady called Nancy. And here we are today. And so in our language, we say, Agbena. Thank you, my husband, Ni Tete Takia Boy. I appreciate you coming to Uganda. And I appreciate you choosing me to be your wife.